it's a little different than when you like in here at night, you know what I'm saying? Without everybody, uh, this thing seems a lot more possessed if you will. Yeah. Hey, fellas. Oh, we got a little, what we got here? Hey, man, look, surprise I got for my okay. eyes, man. Okay. Oh, yeah. So, you know, back in the day, man, this building used to be a mafia red casino. Right? So, I feel like it might be time for us to bring this place back to its heyday. Take it all over. Oh, Lord. What's some fancy dice you got there? If you look at these dice, man, they have all the combinations of us. Then you have all the locations of top names. Whoever's name comes up first on the die needs to go wherever the second die tells him to. Marcus, you a gambling man, right? How about you give it a roll? Here we go. Look, get over it, man. Hey, you got to hey, keep both hands on his table. You know, he's like, cheat. Here we go. You can't cheat them. Carl's apartment, Marcus. Ooh, what kind of dice are y'all using? It looks like the spirits chose you, bro. So that means this is his Bible and glasses. Man, that's really personal. Yeah. Just be careful, bro, because they say, you know, they possessions happen up there, or attachments happen up there. So why aren't y'all coming up there? Don't worry about it. We got a pastor. We'll see that. All right, we'll get to it, man. Well, Carl's apartment, man. Get your ass on up in there. Let's get it. If you get too close to it, there it is. That's creepy. Wait, man. We'll be right in the DJ room. Good luck with my young trash. Hey, I love you, bro. Shut up. Alright, let's see what Marcus got going on, bro. <laughs> What's going on, Carl? <laughs>